Oh, hey guys. Today on Bushcraft Bros, we're going to make a Siberian fire. So stick around, check it out. Okay, so we need four big logs for our Siberian fire. I found this tree right here. Uh, it's dead, it's big, and uh, we're gonna try and chop it down. I think it's gonna go our way, Mike. Okay, yeah, it's going up, just keep going there. Ready? It's going to go the way we want here. Let's move. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Even in the right spot. Ah, uh, yeah. Look at that, Jimmy. So, for a Siberian fire, you need to find a fairly big-sized tree in diameter uh, and about the same diameter as high up as you, you can find. And then you need to cut it in about four to six feet lengths. Uh, it's a bit of a pain. We've been going at this tree for probably half an hour, 45 minutes now. But uh, it pays off in the end. So the biggest two pieces right here. We got the base, right? And the yeah. center piece. And then we'll cut a couple more for the smaller ones. Okay. Okay, I'll take this. Okay. These are uh, the biggest chunks for sure. Careful that we don't get it underneath. Okay, yeah. That looks good. Uh, this is the middle one. You got the big end though. Yeah. Lift your end right in the center, okay. man. Straight over top? Yeah. Is that good? Yeah, I think that's good. Yeah. Next one, uh, buying end. We'll go like this. With a bit of a gap, right? Yeah. Not that much, but like, we'll go like this. Like, oh, yeah. Sorry. That'll like. That. He's yeah. the expert. Just enough so it's leaking through there. So, as the ends burn off, we'll just move these up a bit, and it's throwing a ton of heat back into the shelter behind us. Well, I'm sure it is. I'm going to check. <laughs> yeah. And it doesn't take oh, much yeah. wood. Yeah, it's throwing heat. And that is a Siberian fire. This just looks like shrapnel, hey? Yeah. This is all that's left of the Siberian fire. What'd you do last night? You uh, took the... Jeff took the middle log. Yep, the base log was gone when I got up. The base log was totally gone. I heard the fire fall, so all the logs fell flat. And I took the next biggest log and stuffed it underneath. And kind of rebuilt it with just four sticks. Four logs. <laughs> 